All right, are you ready to navigate Christmas dinner this year? <laughs> well, we're here to make sure you are prepared. Etiquette expert Lisa Grotz joins us now to break down the do's and don'ts of Christmas etiquette. Merry Christmas to you, Lisa. Thanks for joining us. Merry Christmas. Thanks for having me. Sure. Let's go through the don'ts first so everyone knows what okay. not to do. <laughs> right. Where should we start? Let's see. Christmas <laughs> don'ts. What if you don't get a di gift that you like? Don't make a big fuss about it, right? It's just right. one gift. Be polite and be gracious and say everyone's two favorite words, which are thank, thank you. Thank you. And what? ask, ask yeah. for different food, you say? Don't ask for different food. Oh, yeah. It's, it's important not to ask for the host for different foods that aren't on the menu. For example, you're not at a restaurant. You're at somebody's home. So eat what you can. And if you don't, then stop for a burger on the way home. However, if you have a legitimate food allergy, you should tell your host well in advance so she can hopefully accommodate you. Uh, you know, I got a buddy, Bob, that uh, he's my age, but he's got younger sisters that are in their mid-20s. He's a Trump guy, and they're big Bernie Sanders people. And uh, oh, he always wonders, what do you do? <laughs> what do you do <laughs> yeah. at Christmas time when everybody gets together? I say we leave the politics to Fox News. I mean, everything in politics is so divisive right now that it's just not a really great Christmas topic. Instead, I was thinking this morning it would be fun to go around and ask all of your guests about their favorite Christmas memory. We mm. all have one. It's so much better to keep things light. Mm. And you know that if someone starts talking about one story, it's going to lead to others and probably much, much better conversation. Well, apparently 60% of people avoid controversial topics at Christmas yeah. gatherings. So it sounds like uh, that majority anyway, agreeing with you. Let's talk about the do's now. And you say do spread the joy. Absolutely. It's so easy to make someone's day by buying them a cup of coffee or, you know, dropping your extra coins in a red bucket. It is, after all, the season of giving. And for some reason, the month of December, it's just it just feels good to do for others. You know, and yeah. we definitely yeah. get when we give. I just it feels great. Yesterday, I was in a parking lot, a packed parking lot, and I was trying to find a spot. And a girl walking to her car said, oh, you know, I'm parked over here. Uh, and I was like, oh, cool. And then when I was leaving, I passed it along and I did the same for someone go. else. See? Good for you. Simple. Yeah. Random acts or acts of kindness, it's the way to go. Yeah. And it really makes someone's day. It and, really does. And, Something and, small like that. Yeah, and getting away from the freaking iPhone is just a, a great <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, there I we mean, go. That's just so yeah. good. Tell well, you know, I, here's the deal. Here's the rule. If it is not meant for the table, it doesn't belong. It is that simple. So how about this? Let's try to reconnect the old fashioned way is an in interpersonal communication. Do you guys remember that when we used to make eye contact versus just I know. contact with our to phone? Talk? That was cool. Oh my gosh. I mean, I know it's hard not to be on your phone the whole day, but at least at the dinner table, my sister has a basket and she just passes it around and has everyone just put their phone in the basket. We oh, can wow. do that for there an was hour the number right there. It's not and, that hard. And we all kind of want it, but we're all, it's like everybody that wants Absolutely. to quit smoking. You want the cigarette, right. too. You also want the phone, but you want to get rid of it. Everything. Um, right. It's tough. It's an addiction. Lisa, thanks so much. It's a good day so to much. take a break. Absolutely. Thank you, and Merry Christmas. You Merry too. Christmas. Thank you. Thank you. It is 27 minutes after the hour. The